Joining me now is the Portadown goalkeeper, Tim Dalton. Tim, you'll be a busy man tomorrow, perhaps. Well, hopefully not. Um, but if the, the other two games that we've played against him so far this season are anything to go by, I probably will be, yes. Just a quick uh, word about uh, your fitness. There was some uh, doubt of you playing tomorrow. The flu, the flu's cleared up? Well, I'm not too bad now. I trained last night. I, I felt okay. Um, I took a couple of days off earlier in the week. I was feeling quite bad, but um, I'll be there tomorrow. OK, well, we can have a look at that match against Cliftonville uh, just a couple of months ago. You lost 3-1 at Solitude that day, but uh, obviously a very different game tomorrow down at your patch. Well, hopefully, because um, we're, we're riding high at the moment and uh, we're starting to run into some good form. But also, they're doing very well, you know, and they're lasting the pace quite nicely. Good side, nice aren't they? Now. They are a good side, and they've got two very dangerous frontmen, which makes it doubly this difficult. Is, this is the name McCann and uh, Tolan, I think, who's just back from Bolton on trial. Yes, uh, he's done really well. He's been the find of the season so far. Well, listen, enough for them, because you've got a find of the season of your own. Uh, Billy Woods, just tell us a bit about him, where he's come from. This is his goal against Glenavon. Yes, well, Billy was with um, Tranmere Rovers in England, and uh, he came back and we signed him on a free transfer this summer. And he's done extremely well for us so far, scored some very important goals. As has Mr Arkins. I mean, you know, you're going to tell me it's a, it's a team that does well, but how important is Vinnie Arkins to you? This is a hat-trick he scored against Glenavon. Well, he's vitally important because he's scored. He's a leading goal scorer in the league so far. He's got, I think, it's 24 goals. But also, not to forget, um, Gary Haylock. And they're a great partnership. And Gary's been having a good season also. And I think he's on about 13. Can you explain then to the Portadown fans? You won the championship uh, two seasons ago. Last year was one to forget. And now you're back up top again. And what's the difference with this time and last year? Well, this time and last year, um, last season, I think it's also, I think it's very difficult following a season where you've won it. Um, Possibly, you know, you're, you're not on the same level. Um, you've won it before. Your confidence isn't possibly what it should be. I don't know. It's, it's very difficult to explain sometimes why. And what we mentioned earlier, a bit of a gap just appearing at the top of the table because you're four points clear of Ballam and eight clear of Linfield at that moment and 11 clear of the likes of Glenavon. Uh, if you win tomorrow, you could be looking very good. Well, it's a four-point gap for us and uh, hopefully it's a big game. We have to win it. Um, a draw, I suppose, would be acceptable, but we're going for a win. We'll have the goals on... Uh...